In this video, I'll show you how to create animated cartoon style videos using AI. And the best part is, this method is 100% free. Summary Dubai. I've never experienced heat like this before. How can it be so hot and it's only June? Oh, you haven't seen anything yet? June is just the teaser. July and August are the main events. How do people even manage? I mean, going about their day-to-day -day activities. Well, we adapt. Most of us stay indoors during peak hours. First of all, we need a script for the cartoon video. So I'll go to ChatGPT and ask it to create a video script of two people talking about summer in Dubai. As you can see, ChatGPT creates imaginary scenes along with the theme and background, as well as the dialogues. Now I know what my cartoon scenes would look like. I can now start the video creation process. There are lots of softwares which you can use to create these cartoon videos, but most of them are paid ones. On the other hand, this particular software, Plotivon Studio, provides a free trial of one month, so I'll download and install it. Currently, you can install it on Windows, Android, and iOS devices. Unfortunately, the voiceover profiles in this software are not great. So I'll generate the voiceovers from Play HD website because up to 2,500 words are free. If you want to monetize the videos, just purchase a subscription on this platform. Or if you want a huge library of human-like AI voices, then subscribe to Synthesia. I already made a complete video about both of these platforms. So after installing the plot of on Studio, you need to sign up with your email account or use your Google account. Next, click on the Create Video button to create a project. On this blank scene, simply click on this A icon to start creating text to video. On the left side, we have the editor panel. Simply write an opening text to start the video. You can also change the text position, as well as select a voiceover profile. By clicking on the speaker icon, you can adjust the sound of this text and can also listen to the voiceover by clicking on this play button at the right side. If you want to add some music in this scene, then click on this icon to select it from the default library of the software. Next step is to create our first video scene. Click on this movie icon to add a movie scene. Now click on the scene text to open up the backgrounds library. There are lots of backgrounds, so I'll just choose the one related to my script dialogues. Now the next step is to create our cartoon characters. By clicking on this no actor text, we can access the characters library. There are lots of characters to choose from, but you can also build your own style of character. So let's build it. First, you need to define a gender for that character. Next step is to customize the face shape of that character as well as change the skin color by selecting it from the color palette here. You can also change the hairstyle, add a mustache, eye color, and shape. You can also select the clothes and shoes for that character. By clicking on this icon, you can also select a voice preset for that character if you are using the built-in voiceover presets. By clicking on the A icon, you can write a name for that character. So I'll put the one which was suggested by ChatGPT. Now click on the Done button to save the character. As you can see, our character is saved in the library. You can repeat the same steps to create the second character. But for now, I'll just choose a pre-made character. Now the next step is to position the characters in the background scene. By click on this position menu, you can define a position which is linked to the background scene. To add our second character to the scene, simply click on this red button again to open up the character library and select the one you want. In the same way, set its position according to the scene. Now the next step is to change the angle of this scene or camera style. Simply click on this camera icon to open up the camera menu and then select your desired camera angle. You can also add sound effects to this scene by clicking on this icon and choose one from the built-in library. Now we need to set up our dialogues. By clicking on this button, you can add your dialogues under the camera scene. Now select the character from the menu with which you want this dialogue to be linked. If you are going to use the built-in voiceover profiles of this software, then simply copy the dialogue text from ChatGPT for the selected character and paste it here. By clicking on this microphone icon, you can listen to this dialogue voiceover, but you can also import your own audio file from here. You can either record those dialogues by yourself or use a better text-to-speech platform. So let's head over to Play HD website and generate some nice voiceovers for free. Sign up for a free account. In the studio dashboard, paste your first dialogue text and then click on this voiceover profile text. Make sure you have selected the Play HT 2.0 tab. Choose a voice profile according to your preferences and click on the confirm button. Now at the end of your first dialogue text, press the enter key on your keyboard to add the second character. Copy the second character's dialogue from ChatGPT and paste it here in Play HD. Change the voice profile for this dialogue from here. Repeat these steps with all of the dialogues. By the way, it doesn't have to be in English language. You can translate those dialogues into any language and then select the language profile accordingly to generate your voiceovers. Because the Plotagon Studio works based on your audio file, doesn't matter what the language is, it just animates the characters based on the audio file. 
Now click on Generate All Paragraphs button to generate the voice previews in the timeline at the bottom. Once done, click on the Export button and select each paragraph separately from the menu. Now we can import our dialogues for each character step by step in Plotagon Studio. Click on Import Voice File and select the related audio file for this dialogue. To save the changes, click on this checkmark button. Click on the Play button to check how the scene looks like with our custom audio file. Now to add the dialogue of our second character, click on this icon, choose the character from the menu, copy the dialogue text from ChatGPT and paste it here. By the way, you can also add some gestures to the characters by clicking here on the dialogue section. And finally, you can add all the dialogues in the similar way. If for some reason you want to change the scene for some dialogues, you can do the same steps as before by clicking on this icon, select a background, and add your characters, and then put the dialogues. That way, you can generate multiple scenes in the project to build a story. And lastly, to export the video, click on the export icon at the top right corner. Select the option render the video. Now choose a resolution from here, I'd suggest 1080p. Click on Render Video button and select to export with subtitles in external file to upload them separately on YouTube or embed them on the video natively. And if you don't want the subtitles, then click on Export without subtitles. And here's a short sample of this video. Summer in Dubai. I've never experienced heat like this before. How can it be so hot and it's only June? Oh, you haven't seen anything yet? June is just the teaser. July and August are the main events. How do people even manage? I mean, going about their day-to-day -day activities. Well, we adapt. Most of us stay indoors during peak hours. It is totally up to you to use your creativity and create multiple different scenes and build a story with different camera angles and backgrounds. And I don't think you need any other software to create cartoon movies because Plotagon Studio is more than enough to create dynamic scenes. And yes, if you have great quality AI voiceover in your cartoon videos, then you can definitely upload and monetize these videos on YouTube. Just make sure to do the proper SEO on every single video, upload the subtitles file separately, which was generated by Plotivan Studio, and create a nice thumbnail by taking a snapshot of a scene from the video creating a 1920 by 1080 canvas in Canva, upload the snapshot here and add the text. Spend some time on this and make everything look professional. For video description, just ask ChatGPT to create a YouTube video description for this script with the main keyword as cartoon. If the content is made for kids, then make sure to select it from here when uploading the video on YouTube. You also have to be careful with the dialogue since there are some strict policies by YouTube about kids' content. That's it. If you want to learn more about premium AI human-like voiceover platforms, then watch this video right here.